I think it's very important when you go to a club to know what the club wants and to try to deliver what what the club wants. Uh, of course, Champions League is uh, is a big question mark always, especially because uh, you when you go to knockouts, the knockouts they have this unpredictability, but also because of the power of the opposition you you are going to get. Um, but my agreement with Inter was exactly that the first season was um, to keep that dominancy in Italian football, so to win the, the title for the, the third consecutive time, but at the same time to fill the needs for uh, the Champions League. And uh, I was waiting and waiting, and the moment we were knocked out of the Champions League was against Manchester United. In that moment was the moment where uh, I made my, my report to the club, and I told uh, the owner and uh, the sports director, for me, this is what we need to bring the team to, to, the, next, uh, to the next level. And again, I think the work uh, the club did was, um, was phenomenal in that, in, in that summer. Uh, the market was tremendous. Then we had some, some crucial players, some key players to a team that was incredible by by in some aspects of the game and then we went to that Champions League with with the ambition and uh, and we did it we we were a team that defensively we were phenomenal on on a low block but um, we need I felt that we need to to bring the line up uh, 20 more meters to make the team much more dominant, to press higher, to be stronger. And um, I had a group of, uh, of central defenders quiet in the last period of their career. And we need um, a fast center defender. That was fundamental for us. Um, I wanted uh, Ricardo Carvalho. Uh, we tried, we tried strong. Uh, was not possible with Chelsea. And then, uh, credit to the people that deserve the credit. My little structure in the club, that's why sometimes I say that um, sometimes simplicity is genius and complexity is to hide that you are not good enough. We, we had such a simple structure that immediately come with the name uh, Lucio is the perfect player because is really, really fast. Uh, probably technically is not what, what you, you want from a player like Ricardo, but he is really, really fast. And uh, he will give us what we want. Uh, then uh, we need to improve um, our passing quality in, in midfield. Uh, we had fantastic players, very strong in midfield. People like uh, Zanetti, Stankovic, Montari, but we need to be more dominant, to be more in control, we need we need different, and uh, and Schneider was was the key for us. And then in in attack, uh, of course, we lost uh, Zlatan to to Barcelona, but we changed Zlatan for Milito and Eto. So the approach was was very simple, and the team become become really adapted, not just to keep dominating the Serie A, but also that kind of team, that kind of, of strong, scenic, intelligent, pragmatic team that could do it in, in Europe against the best teams. It was not an easy way to, uh, to do it. Uh, we were not uh, a lucky team in the draws, uh, we start by having immediately Barcelona in the group phase. Uh, then we go to the knockout and uh, we play Chelsea in the first knockout, knockout uh, tie. And then we have Barcelona again in the semifinals. And then we go to the final and we have Bayern Munich. So it was, was really, really strong. So I think it was a, a very good um, 
achievement for us, but especially because we broke that psychological wall, you know, uh, 50 years without doing it. And if you remember what Inter was in the 80s, in the 90s, almost every top player in the world played for Inter. If you are going back and you remember the Germans, Mateos, Bremen, Klinsmann, and then you go to to Seydorf and to Davids, and uh, and then you go to to Ronaldo Nazario and uh, Adriano. It looks like uh, every top player in the world played for Inter, and they never managed to, to to do it. So to break that that psychological wall was was very important. And uh, the game against Chelsea in the last 16 was probably the key the key moment. Was the moment where people start believing and feeling that we had we had a team for for that to come to Stamford Bridge and and win there I think was was the click that um, the team needed